We get started with some uh, developing news right away. Yeah, and we've been waiting to hear from Senator Al Franken on his political future, and he is scheduled to deliver a speech from the Senate floor at 1045 our time. We will carry it live here on WCCO. So this comes one day after multiple Democratic senators called on Franken to resign yesterday over allegations of sexual misconduct. Most recently, a former Democratic congressional aide claimed Franken tried to forcibly kiss her in 2006. More than half of his fellow Democrats in the Senate say they want him out with female senators leading the way. I think when we start having to talk about the differences between sexual assault and sexual harassment and unwanted groping, you are having the wrong conversation. You need to draw a line in the sand and say none of it is okay, none of it is acceptable, and we as elected leaders should absolutely be held to a higher standard, not a lower standard. It is probably in um, the best interest of, of a lot of people that he resigns. CBS News has learned that Franken and his wife met with Democratic leader Chuck Schumer yesterday, and Schumer told Franken it is time to step down. Franken's office said yesterday that he had not made a final decision on whether he will stay or go, but one would presume he has made that choice at least by now, with that 1045 announcement expected. If Franken does resign, Governor Mark Dayton would then appoint a 10-month replacement. And the Senate seat would be up for grabs in the 2018 election. Again, Senator Franken scheduled to speak on the Senate floor at 1045. We'll carry it live here on WCCO and on WCCO.com.